Doma Sports Talk Worldwide with some news from the world of boxing. So y'all know what time it is. You ain't in a rush to get concussed, baby. Now, there's some interesting news with Canelo. Now, I don't have my told you hat on. I ain't at home. I had to put it on for show. Because I've been saying this for the longest. Canelo Alvarez, which we all know, have said in the last day or two that uh, he's not going to fight any Mexicans. Now, he just reiterated this. He said this a couple of years ago. And when he said this, I was like, okay, you know, well, what's the translation? Because he's fought Mexicans already. Obviously, from a fan perspective or for a person who just has common sense and, you know, you know, don't have anything invested in this, you listen to things like that and then you translate it. My translation was, oh, that just means he's not going to fight David Benavides and Gilberto Ramirez. I've been saying that for two years now. So at the end of the day, that's what's going on because he's on a collision course with uh, Gilberto Ramirez back then because Ramirez was at 168 pounds and Canelo was comp uh, comp uh, contemplating going up to 168 pounds. And he knew Gilberto Ramirez is there. And Ramirez wants to fight him, right? But it didn't, it, you know, he doesn't want to fight Ramirez and David Benavides, who is probably American. I'm not sure, but David Benavides is American of Mexican descent. So what are we going to do with Canelo? We're going to have an ancestry check right before every you know if somebody three generations slept with a mexican and somebody has a little mexican in them 10 percent, he ain't gonna fight no mexicans now you gotta ask yourself if you're not gonna fight charlo andre right then you're not gonna fight mexicans and here's the kicker if gilberto ramirez who's gonna fight uh dimitri bivel right in a highly anticipated fight i think it's gonna be a barn barn burner of a fight He's not going to fight Bivol if Bivol loses to Gilberto Ramirez. So you're not fighting B B Gilberto Ramirez. You're not fighting Bivol if he loses. You damn sure ain't going to fight Bivol if he win. You're not going to fight Andre. You're not going to fight Charlo. You know, so who in the hell is left? You only have sideshow fights, which I've been saying for a long time. People is upset when I call him Sideshow Bob, right? Two years ago. Because it's just really, you know, kind of like sideshow fights. I can tell you, I knew he was going to fight Gennady Golovkin after Bivol, for example. I knew that, right? You can call the fights that what he's going to do. You know, he's going to look for who is the easiest one that people might give props to, right? So that's that's what's really going on with the man. Um, you know, we just got to just be blatant and, and call it out what it is. I don't think that most fighters can say, hey, I'm not going to fight somebody, from, you know, my nationality or, you know, people of my the same descent. Right. It's like, you know, so I ain't fighting no brothers. Right. Because, you know, what? how would a black, could a black person say that? I ain't fighting no black people. You know what I'm saying? And then what What you got? So you got Africans, you got Cubans, you got Dominican Republic, you got, you know, Americans, you got Englishmen. So what does that mean? You see what I'm saying? So where will we go? That should be stopped from Mexicans right away. Canelo, the hell with that. Well, we, this is not, we can't, well, we can't find out the best. If the best are two Mexicans, then we won't find out the best. Don't, Canelo doesn't want to be the best Mexican, for example, or what? You know, what does that mean? This is a sport. Well, that would mean, you know, hey, we ain't going to have the NBA Finals. I got some brothers on that team I ain't trying to play against. You know, what does that mean? Duncic, he's got, he's Slovenian. He's got a Slovenian on another team. He can't play against them because they're Slovenian. You know, it just doesn't work in sports. And I think we need to make that clear to Canelo instead of just saying, well, you know, Canelo said this and it's okay. Because I don't think that any other boxers would be allowed to say that. So it's pitiful to me. But if Canelo's not allowed to fight Mexicans and he's not allowed to fight these undefeated brothers, then who the hell are we going to have left? And that is not worthy of a number one or top 10 pound for pound person. If he's going to be a sideshow over there, then cool. But if he's top 10 pound for pound, we can't accept him not wanting to fight any Mexicans. You get it? Doma Sports Talk Worldwide. And I'm up out of here, y'all.